Hi, Rick Berry from Michigan Toy Soldier Company, and today I'm unboxing the new Bolt Action Miniatures German Infantry plastic set from World War II. These are 28 millimeter injection molded plastic figures. Opening up the box, we get five sprues of figures and components to make up 25 different figures, three sprues of bases, and three sprues of weapons. The nice thing about this system is it's also interchangeable with Bolt Action's metal range. You can use the heads between the two series. There's assembly required. Uh, the plastic is nice, hard, German field gray. The detail is very nice and crisp. And with all these different arms and packs, you can, you can make up a variety of figures. As you can see from the sprue, there's a lot of little parts. So I'm going to give you a quick example of how to assemble some of these figures. Assembly of the figure is pretty straightforward. Um, after removing the parts I've chosen from the provided key, I've decided to build a figure holding a 98K. I'm going to assemble them with super glue. A little dab on the... I like to put the figure on the base first. That gives me something to hold on to to attach the parts. Dab a super glue on each foot. And because I'm a very impatient person, I like to cheat and use accelerator. I put a drop on each side, right out of the bottle using the stem rather than the spray. And now my figure is ready for assembly. As you can see, I've already assembled the arms on this guy because it takes a little bit of time. Straight, again, that was straightforward, done with super glue. Now I'm going to add his weapon, the K98. I put a dab of super glue on his hand and on his other hand. I insert the rifle right where I want it. Again, being the impatient type that I am, I give it a little whack of accelerator. And the nice thing about these figures is you can use the heads from their metal range also. They're interchangeable. It's called the interchangeable head system. The plastic heads can go on the metal figures and the metal heads can go on the plastic figures. So I'm using a uh, bear cap, bear headed uh, SS head from their Waffen SS set. I put a little dab of super glue on there. And unfortunately I've got big stubby fingers that get in the way all the time. Hit it with a little accelerator. And my figure is done. Uh, the other nice thing about the Warlord system is you can you can have these figures with packs, without packs, with partial packs. Interchangeable heads, you name it. It's, it's a great system, lots of variety. You can make 25 figures, but with a several boxes, the, the variety of poses is endless. Uh, don't forget to come back to Michigan Toy Soldier on YouTube for more unboxing and how-to videos.